receptions. Let's go to Dallas. It's the uh, home debut of uh, interim head coach Jason Garrett taking on the Lions. Man. And that's Des Bryant. He is a playmaker. He's turning into a he's, he's a playmaker of the first sort. Right. A-list playmaker right. in this league. But John Kitna, oh. before the end of the half, nice. hands it off to, uh, to uh, Felix Jones. Who puts the ball on the turf? Kyle Vandenbosch recover, uh, hits him. DeAndre Levy recovers, and Nate Burleson turn that pick and that uh, turnover into points. So it's 12 7 after the Lions get a safety when Brian McCann takes the ball on a punt, even though John Wendling tipped it for the Lions. That's a live ball for Dallas to pick up and run back for a touchdown. This is a smart play because the ball's not down just because you tip it. It's a rule of first touch that's not down yet. You got to tip it down. You got to down it for a wh with a whistle on the official. McCann made a heads up play. Two games in a row. Game right. changing play. He had the 101 pick six last week on Eli Manning. Same score with the Cowboys up 14-12. It's Miles Austin in the Off end the zone. Milk card. 21 to 12. Sean Hill had a nice game. 289 yards. Mm -hmm. Here's a nice touchdown. That is to amazing. Calvin Johnson. He caught it all the way. The process was nice. So the Lions are in this thing 21-19, but Kit, you, you sure. don't don't sleep on the kitten of revenge. Kitten is good, man. Lions. He can play. Uh, I mean. Uh, Packers will probably say otherwise. 28-19 is the score there. Ooh. And Kitten Ooh. untouched rolling out. Get it in, John. That's a 29-yard uh, bootleg. And the Cowboys are 2-0 and under Garrett. What we're finding out about our football team is it's got a lot of fight. It's got a lot of fight. And, uh, you know, the, the, the offense is struggling early on. The defense is picking them up. The special teams is making big plays week in and week out. And then, you know, the offense gets going, you know, when the defense is out there for too long and all those things. And, you know, we talk about that. You know, it's not a question of whether or not adversity is going to happen. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. How do you respond to it individually as a unit and as a football team? And our guys are doing that week in and week out. And that's a real positive sign for our team.